Jasmine wants to know if I've met Shane Dawson. No, but I'd love to. When I was starting YouTube, Shane Dawson was one of my influences. Oh my god, if you ever told 16-year-old Dan that Shane Dawson would want to make a video with me, I'd stab myself in the face. <laughs> I'm not joking. He looks like somebody that would get fucked so hard on Stickham. Like, he would just go to a Stickham and he would just be getting face fucked. <laughs> like, 3 a.m. 500 people watching, me included. I guess I've never really had the confidence. And with, like, the confetti on his head, it's like, party boy. God, I don't want to fuck that mouth. That hair. I can't judge it, because I've had that hair. But just because your straightener goes up to 500 degrees does not mean you need to go there. That hair. That hair is burnt. <laughs> Dan and Phil actually really like them, but no, fashion choices, they're on the same level. We're in the me. worst it's pair of sneakers I ever did Was see. he wearing his leather shirt? It's probably No. Okay, I that... think it was leather pants. Ooh, yeah. But they were so sweet, I met them. No, the they're the sweetest. Time. I like them me, a lot. Me and, yeah. Dan have, uh, me and Dan have the same legs, and we both should not wear leather pants. But oh. bitches are crying and hyperventilating. Like, I know. <laughs> I'm like, no. get your life together, girl. Mm -hmm. What you, you know what I like? Guys? You know what I like about Dan and Phil, though, is that they're so... That's what I like about YouTube in general. <clears throat> well, it's getting worse, but... Now it's like just average looking people, which I love. I love that it's average looking people. A half of a Dan and Phil. Only a half? Which one? Mm -hmm. The cute one's bottom half. They're both cute. <laughs> <laughs> Babe! I think they're both cute. Liar. And by the way, the cute one, they're, they're both cute. <laughs> I have his bottom half with the same legs. Really? Yeah. Thick legs. More meaty. <laughs> Oh, we need to end this with something really nasty. Ooh, okay, this one's about Dan and Phil. Phil couldn't help but admire Dan's body. He wasn't the most muscly of people, but that didn't matter. Damn, the shade. Okay, I'm gonna fast forward to the fuck. Okay, here's a question for you. Dan asked Phil why he was straight to his eyes. Phil didn't notice why. That was funny, Dan. Now look at Twitter. No, I wanna know. Ooh, respect Phil. Dan had to look closer to Phil and ran his hand across Phil's thigh. Phil gulped, trying not to moan in pleasure. Oh, I was obviously just saying. In reaction, Dan snickered and moved his hand on Phil's crotch and gave him a hit squeeze. Without thinking, Phil gave him a deep moan and crossed his hand over his mouth in horror and embarrassment. He had no control. I'll take that as a yes. Exploded inside of Dan's mouth. The both boys passed out in exhaustion and pleasure. You tasted so good, Dan stated. Now let's get back to the Q&A. <laughs> oh my god, I think I'm done. Can you imagine, like, during the Q&A, like, they're both in onesies and they're like, Hey, what's your favorite color? And then he's like, hey, let's take these onesies off and fuck. Honestly, I thumbs up. The amazing book is not on fire. This is from YouTube stars. Dan is not on fire and amazing Phil. They're British, they wear all black, and they have my hair from five years ago. My goal in life is to get spit roasted by them. If you don't know what that means, look it up. Dan, 6'3", holy fuck. He's 6'3"? You know what that means. Dan is not on fire, but my ass is. And it ends with him. Oh, I love that. Begins with him, ends with him, and then it's over. Just like life. And then you put me in the middle. And I'm spit roasted. Dan and Phil. I know one is a skeptic and one isn't, so. Well, read the one that isn't. Yeah. And Wait, you. But their their whole thing, which I feel like we talked about, but their whole thing is that everybody thinks they're a couple. Well, yeah. Yeah, yeah we've never discussed that. We <laughs> never did. We never did. But what if we collab? Can you hook us up? <laughs> oh, wait a second. Why are you afraid to collab with this Dan? <laughs> are you afraid we'll see too much? That is the theory that Dan and Phil really are. Okay, first yes! Of all, we start this one. Yes, gonna, let's get it. Let's talk about this one. I'm not saying that they're gay. Woo! Here we go. This theory does have a lot I think they're together. So as you guys know, Dan and I love it. been doing videos together for years. Yeah. And pretty much since they started, their fans have been convinced that they are together. But the theory that they actually are in a relationship has been something that they haven't really talked about. No. There's just a couple little clues. They just make fun, like, jokes. Mm -hmm. Number one, back in 2009, Dan tweeted, Uma Thurman just watched me have sex. Now just check out this picture of Phil's bedroom and you will see that there is a poster of Kill Bill right above his bed. So Uma mm -hmm. Thurman watched Dan have sex with Phil. Oh, no. <laughs> Thurman, in there. Maybe it wasn't Phil that Dan had sex with. Just check out this picture of my bedroom from 2009. You notice anything? Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Another is brought to us by a YouTuber named Michelle Foddy. And she believes that there is a picture out there of Dan and Phil almost kissing. Check it out. 
and this was the picture before, and then they ick the exposure on the picture. Oh. And you can clearly see it's Dan and Phil, and it almost looks like Dan is kissing Phil on the cheek or something of the sort. I don't know. I, feel I mean, like I that one's together really anyway. suspicious. But not only did she find that picture, she also found something interesting that Dan wrote in for. He was also asked, is there a song where every time you hear it, you think of someone? And he replied, fireworks and then, like, dash fill heart. Yeah, so all of those are, like, kind of vague little clues. But what I personally think is that they're not in a relationship, and I think that they are fucking with us. I think that they are purposely putting those things <laughs> I think out it's there, together. putting out those tweets, and making all the fans kind of speculate. But, Maybe like, keeping, the, keeping it, like, mm. well, are they or are they not? I would be lying if I said I So I see them have girls in their videos, then. This is weird for me to talk about because I feel like it's like this weird outing thing and I don't want to do that. But their fans are convinced that Dan and Phil, YouTubers Dan and Phil, are oh. actually in a gay relationship and they've been together the whole time. I don't think they are. I think they're just fucking with the audience and they probably think it's funny and like, you know, their fan fashion fiction is funny. is not gay enough. I've seen their sneakers <laughs> in real life and they're like, no way they are gay. Right. But their audience is convinced. They have created this, this story in their head that they are together. Now, as psychics, what do you see for Dan and Phil's okay. relationship? Well, we you invited know. them on our show. As you yes. know, you were there. And uh, they still haven't taken us up on it, even after we said, what are you hiding, Dan and Phil? <laughs> we were pretty open about right. wanting them to come on the show, but right. they avoided right. coming on this for is whatever what, reason. This or they is just honestly, didn't I don't know. <laughs> no, they saw it because they were going, we'll see you in the future, the next video they made. Yeah. Wait, what? They did That's our, they, why I know they, they saw it. They did our outro. <laughs> they did funny. our outro. They did. And, uh, and anyway, so <laughs> I, this is what I think. I, we don't okay. out people, Shane, right. okay. as you know. No. But fun. I think that they have a thing. You do? Yes. I, I think they did and, and do. Oh my God. But, uh, you know, here we said we aren't going to add anybody. Is this okay? Yeah. Okay. What do you think? What do you think, Drew? It's not, you know. I can't comment on that. <laughs> oh, no come way. Come on, Drew. They have Eiffel Tower Drew last week, so that's why <laughs> you Who are you, Sean I Spicer? Think, Jeez. I think, personally, <laughs> I think that, um, I wish they did. I just have a weird feeling that they don't. I'm I telling you, the sneakers, I've seen them. But I also maybe think they do, and I'm afraid to say it because I don't want to out them. You know what I mean? Well, yeah. Remember what happened with Cameron, Fifth Harmony, and. Oh, right. Because you guys predicted that uh, some of the Fifth Harmony members were dabbling. And, and we were right. And we were right. right. And right. then the aunt came out and confirmed it. And oh, interesting. Okay. Dina. On the tape. So for, Dina's aunt. For all the Dana Phil fans, psychic twins think they're together, so you're welcome. Mm. Or at least you're off to that. Now you can make hate videos just about that. No, you know, no, seriously. <laughs> Ooh! <laughs> no judgment, but damn, his sneezes are fucking wet. You could use that for lube. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I shouldn't be talking, but damn, can you imagine sitting in front of him at the movies, I'm getting hard just thinking about it? I'm looking at my phone, and I get a DM from Phil that says, "Can you please stop mentioning us in videos? It's kind of scary and weird. Thanks." <laughs> we watch. We watch. Dan and Phil. Dan, Dan and Phil. We never watch. We, we never, never watch. Shane Dawson. Shane Dawson. <laughs> now, Shane Dawson reacted to your first video. I saw. Thanks, Shane. What if you cut your hair like Shane? I feel like Shane just looks like. A, a random man now that he's had his haircut, but I wasn't, I wasn't, I mean, obviously Shane Dawson, iconic person with iconic hair, but it was never like the best hair, was it? Talk about Shane. I'm out of the loop, uh, as always. Haven't watched it yet, so uh, nothing to react to. Sorry. Does he cry? Shane's a crier, isn't he? <laughs> let's, let's not start a conversation about Shane Dawson because some people have opinions and I'm not in the mood for opinions. Um, are you enjoying England? <laughs> yes, said people. Rude, said somebody else. I'm not, I'm not saying anything. I just don't want to start a conversation where you start saying things. 